Hello friends, very good evening. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Talent Trader. Those who are new to my YouTube channel, kindly subscribe the channel to get more update on intraday and positional trading strategies. And this video, I am going to discuss about my alerts which I am sending to my Telegram channel. So many comments and uh, personal WhatsApp chats are asking you how to trade the, those who are new to my channel they are asking about uh, how to do the signals and how to uh, trade on that so that i'm going to discuss here so we are providing high momentum stocks on uh, my telegram group if you want to join my telegram group the link where i provided in the description you can copy the link and you can uh, go to uh, join my telegram to get this alert and the second one high momentum stocks which we are going to provide you here on that uh, telegram group so this video i'm going to discuss about that uh, intraday scalper buy and uh, sell these are the uh, signals where we are going to uh, providing you alert so these alerts are automated based on the charting scanner i'm not uh, sending you this alert uh, by typing this so it is an automated alert where you are going to get it on directly once the conditions meets on the stock that it's directly send that alert sending to my third party software that sent to my telegram channel and apart from that most of the users are most of my subscribers now we are increasing our subscribers and thanks for that and uh, they are asking about uh, provide me the scanner previously we used uh, doji and uh, ham shooting star hammer a lot of uh, candles six pattern which i provide you a uh, free so after joining my telegram group okay the link which i have given in the description after joining my telegram group just you just uh, go to check the pinned message i have pinned one message on my telegram group there if you are clicking here there is a pin message if i am clicking it that will open a link so yeah where you can find out that a candle six uh, images are on me candle six pattern images there is a link for my scanners instead of searching on uh, charting so there is a link uh, where you can find out that a uh, a link dot me uh, slash uh, slash candle six pattern trader so if you are clicking the link it will redirect to a page where you can find out the candle six pattern so here you can see the single candle six pattern reversal and the double candle six pattern so these are the important candle six which we have already created and i told you how to create the scanners on my videos but even though they are asking you the link send me the link about the video and other things so here if you are clicking this link it will open like this single candle reversal pattern so let me go to say check the daily spinning top daily spinning top at top and bottom hammer candle at bottom shooting star candle at top doji candle at top doji at bottom a bullish meeting line bearish meeting line and in a double candle six we can see bullish engulfing bearish engulfing white inside out up and out down harami bearish and bullish homing pigeon bearish and bull, bullish dark cloud biasing line so just after uh, redirect to this page just click the uh, for example if i'm going to doji at top just i'm clicking that it directly redirect to the page of here you can get the scanner which i have provided free okay so let me go to you can copy and tell people who out this scanner so you can also copy this and uh, just uh, go to backtest result so recently on 30th october torrent pharma doji at doji at top so let me go for a torrent pharma sorry torrent pharma right thirtieth october maybe this here there is a doji at top and there is an entry point below the tail and uh, if stop loss above the level so i'm not going to discuss about that concept i have already made a lot of videos this is the doji where exactly 13th october it forms so the risk for the trade is almost uh, uh, 50 points if the risk is suitable you can go for a trade it is not an intraday trade it is a purely a positional trade which i am going to use for okay so you can click the link and directly go to the page of uh, this one so you can uh, copy the scanners which you want and uh, 
I can add uh, some other uh, scanners also to find out very easiest way in this list so have, after that uh, I can add uh, some other scanners also if you want any scanners to add in this list let me message I will add uh, the public scanners only right so you can easily access my scanners which are directly to the link just uh, it is a uh, pinned on my telegram group okay so let's go to check it out about already 45 degrees so i have some modification so i'll let you make a new video for that so here in this video what we are going to do here so there is a yesterday you can find out there is a two signal uh, one is uh, the intraday scalper buy that is mfsl and the second one which you got uh, intraday scalper buy and the third one is i momentum stock that is about petronet I'm not going to discuss about that high momentum stocks. I can already, I have already made a video for high momentum stock. But here I'm going to discuss how to trade this intraday scalper buy uh, and sell. These are uh, the conditions which I have created on the stock that is forming a such a condition. So such a kind of stocks, I'm focusing it for my trading opportunity. So yesterday you find out the first signal which is generated on EMFSL. So MFSL at uh, around 9.17, it's about the, I'm using the alert time frame, it's about one minute time frame. So if you are using a one minute time frame, the alert came very quick. So someone was asking about what kind of time frame which I am going to focus for uh, alerts. So it is, it, if it is a conditions, it's based on your conditions. So I'm using one minute alert. So what happened in the stock, it was triggering my alert at 9.17. So let I'm going to show you MFSL at 9.17 it is triggering my alert the same time it will be uh, sending you whether it is a buy or a sell. So what it suggests me it is a suggestion that I'm going to focus the MFSL buy at 6.84. So let, let I'm going to make a 5 minute chart. So in a 5 minute chart MFSL given me a buy at 9.17 after market open immediately it generated me a buy signal so let me go to check this is what the uh, day time frame right instead of that uh, I'm going to make a one minute time frame so in one minute time frame you may understand what I'm going to exactly tell you here maybe not at this point one minute time frame so the signal got triggered at this 917 this candle is started at 916 and closed by 917 so I get the alert is exactly 684 so you can cross check with my uh, this price 684 rupees is my buy opportunity it's saying you the buy mfsl so if at this point of 680 you are focusing the buy opportunity at this point and where can i keep my stop loss i can keep the stop loss below to the day low around 679 so the risk for the trade is just about 5 rupees so if I'm making a stop loss at the low, that means when I get an entry, I'm going to keep my day low as a stop. Okay, I made day low as a stop and after I'm waiting for the trade to complete. So here it was after my entry, it is very flat and it is going down nearby my stop loss until it never trigger my stop loss. It missed by one rupee. So good. And let's look at that. There is a movement after in a one minute time frame almost at this time of 12.30 near about it reaches 700 rupees and again it made a high of 704 near about closing hours where I am going to change the 5 minutes time interval so let me confirm that first 5 minutes maybe this is the entry point you keep the low as a stop loss 679 till the day it never triggered your stop loss that means this trade was a profitable trade which you get it right that is what my first opportunity which is happening at 917 if you are a fast trader you can place the order at that point or if you are waiting means there is a price which is below to that particular 684 also after some time but not all the stocks will uh, coming down after entry so the second one which is happening at 933 933 bajaj auto let i'm going to show you the bajaj auto how i'm going to make this signals clear so 9.33 may be at this point, this candle is the entry point, right? So if I'm going to make a one minute time frame, Bajaj Auto, if I'm going to take a 9.33, maybe in this bit between this candle. So if I'm going to open a one minute time frame, 
uh, after it after moving higher then it is fallen down so we have a reversal pattern also to find out at 933 933 this should be the candle we get a led around 3695 we got a this candle at on uh, 932 to 933 so this is what my entry point where i'm keeping my stop loss if i'm keep my stop loss at the day low it should be very high at this point 9695 with the low as 630 almost 65 points so recent low maybe i can keep or the day low also i can keep but i am not going to take a big risk on this trade so i am keeping that recent low that should be a 3665 or even if you are making the stop loss at the lowest level of 3630 and after that market moves to 3719 from at this point of 95 it's just moved but after that it reversed back and if you are keeping keep waiting till end of the day let me go to check the five minutes time frame what happened on that in a five minutes time frame it never trigger your stop loss if you are making a day low and if you are making a swing low that means it came it, it maybe trigger your stop loss but meanwhile it triggers you target also from 95 almost 25 points it's not not triggering your target if you are making the day low as a stop but it was generating some small 30 uh, 25 20 to 25 points movement and the third one which we get it in sell side of world board. let's look at that there is a two sell signals one is uh, uh that is what a world bull so that i'm going to open a world bull so that time what was the time it is generated the signal is around 950 exactly 950 so let me go for a um, five minutes time frame instead of one minute five minutes time frame because if the signal is generated exactly at 950 930, 940, 940, 950. At this point, it triggers you the sale entry around what is the price 1562. Maybe this this candle. This candle is opened by 940 and closed by 950. At this point, we got a trade opportunity. If I'm keeping the day high, it's a huge stop. Alright. So if I'm making the recent high should be 1580 where i'm getting selling at 1562 18.2 should be the stop loss or if you are making a day high it's 1590 from 61 30 points after that it started moving down to 50 so at this point of 62 just generate your 12 points and not moving a big so this is what a, uh, you can focus the liquidity also if you are doing options and uh, this may be another good good intraday stocks so you can avoid also but stop loss is big simply avoid and the second one is again Jindal Steel at the time of 9.53. So yesterday we discussed about Jindal Steel. That is what another signal today triggers at 9.50. This particular candle itself it triggered at 4.53. And the same candle itself it moved a very fast of 4.48. Almost 7 rupees is generated. After that it is slowly recovering. And never trigger your stop loss again. The second chance where 4.51 it came. And closed by 454 it's near about the entry price so meanwhile it generated the seven points it's about the scalping kind of trade where you have entered its quick profit that was is generating the second one is third and the fourth one is i share motor which you are going to focus i share motor 3743 at the time of 10 3 so i share motor so it is also not a good for an entry okay i share motor which triggers you buy at 10 3 maybe at this point 10 to 10 5 so this candle it triggers you your entry 3 7 4 3 and after entry if, if you are making a day low as a stop loss till it is not triggered but at this point you are taking a 3 7 4 3 maybe here and it went up to 3 7 7 2 and after that we get a stock all our high momentum stocks then i'm waiting for the signal which I am going to focus scalping sale or buy. I don't get any stocks. Same like that. Daily it is uh, sending you the alerts on the group. So those who are using, maybe uh, you are not updating me. Uh, I am not expecting that also. If you are making profit, that was good enough, right? Thanks for being with me again. And Godrej properties that was happening at 9:16. So yesterday, Godrej CP consumer product it is happening at 8 24 and titan also be the same time 
Godrej properties and Titan up it's happening at 916 after within a two minutes of opening it's showing you something uh, it's going to happen on the stock so let I'm going to open Godrej properties sorry Godrej CP consumer product that is on 27 it is happening at 916 itself if you are getting a signals earlier it may be a best option so 27 let's look at that this is a five minutes let I'm going to open a one minute time frame what happened on that it's about a 27th not today not yesterday so let's look at that 917 maybe this candle it's closed by 824.65 that exactly we got it on 824.6 at this time we are buying we, we are making a day low as a stop 822 4 rupees that went up to maximum of 833 so almost 4 rupees risk more than 1 is to 2 and the same time Titan same time upon 917 the day 27th by opening yeah it's about a 917 here is the close that is around uh, 2702.65 the exact price which you are uh, 2705 it's showing you 2705 maybe this or this particular area triggers somewhere around 2701 to 2010 is the highest level of that particular one minute candle we got a alert near about uh, 216 916 on 27th and this point so if you are making a day low as a stop loss 2679 it went up to somewhere around uh, 2764 almost 60 60 points it moved and again a jubilean food at 921 jubilean food at 921 27th so what we can go for a five minutes even better chances to find out 921 jubilean food here at 19, 922 925 candle that was and signal got triggered jubilean ford here jubilean 599 so the stock is opened at this point uh, where we get it 9 jubilean ford 921 380 sorry just we check it out jubilean ford 599 600 What exact time of Jubilee and food? So about 9.21. So let me go for a one minute time frame. 27th. Here it may be a stop loss trade. Jubilee and food, 600. 9.21 may be this, around 600. Uh, 9.19, 9.21 is near about 600. And if you are buying that, scalper buy. If you are buying Jubilee and food, and it may be it triggers you the stop at this point of uh, nine uh, exactly 599 if you are making a stop loss around 594 it got triggered right at the same time we pro we got it around 921 we pro it's about a one minute time frame i'm exactly finding out the trade price we pro also triggers you the stop 921 maybe this we got a entry opportunity 386.6 that candle 920 to 921 and it triggers you the day low as a stop or if you are making it the stop as 385 that got triggered and exited out so here this is a scanner which we are filtering out based on some conditions so that may work somewhere around 60 70 percent accuracy if you are making a risk reward management on that so it may be a good so daily we are finding out one or two stocks if you get the stocks earlier starting up the day after 9 15 to 9 30 so there is a good probability of winning on that trade that was working well i hope you understand what i'm discussing in this video so using that alert so even uh, keep supporting me even you can get a lot of uh, um, things on my youtube channel as well as my telegram and i'm going to create a lot of things and i'm going to make a new lives daily market live videos uh, I'm trying to do full day my live, but uh, initially we'll try to do, do it. And uh, once we come uh, done it, uh, so uh, if you we can do a lot, lot more on that. So we can make uh, even algo trading. So a lot of things I'm planning right now. So keep supporting me and subscribe my channel. And thank you for watching this video, and thank you very much. Keep supporting us. Thank you so much.